S104 crosses the line, 125.3 for him, AMW 127 dead, go only a 126.3, near 126.3 as well. Uh, and looks like Zinx a 127.2, Piavana 126.2. That's currently him into second place now. And Pikachu only a 127.6, uh, Billy a 129.8. And then they think the other drivers have not managed to set a valid lap time yet. So, and there's Alka flipping as he's not going to be able to complete that lap for right there. And now Roms are personal best in the first sector. Jazzy personal best in the middle, Ar Billy also um, personal best in the middle, Raf personal best in the first sector. And I think Billy is going to be crossing the line soon. And as he crosses the line, his lap time a 126.2, so that's third fastest for him at the moment. Not too bad for him. And Jazzy now crossing the line. Uh, and it's a 125A, that's third, uh, that's second fastest for him now. So there's many drivers out there still improving right now. Knee has gone personal best. Knee, purple, in the last sector, 125.3, that's fastest right now for him. And now uh, we'll see what Pikachu can do now as he's going to be crossing the line shortly here. Pikachu here, it's a 126.2, that's 5th fastest for him with the purple final sector, Zinx now crossing the line. Can he improve? Yes he can, a 126.5, that pushes Falcon now into the drop zone here. And that's the Williams I think of Pikachu coming into the pits right now, and now Evan crossing the line, can he improve? It's only a 130.1, Rums are 125.7, that's currently 3rd fastest for him here. And Falcon will be next across the line. I've got as well. I've got 126.1. That's sixth fastest for him right now. Falcon only a 127.2. That's still 14th fastest. AMW personal best in the middle sector as well. So AMW is still trying to improve right now. ASM personal best in the first sector. AMW any improves so 125.7. That's gonna set the bar higher for Evan now. And can he get into Q2? No, he can't. So that's gonna be Jerry, Falcon, Evan, and Raph eliminated in Q1. And Jazzy has lost his front wing and he's uh, in the runoff there and he's made a mistake there and that's going to be crucial for him as he's uh, second in the championship and he is going to have to go back to the pits now and he has definitely lost a lot of uh, his time out there and now Ramza is going to be next to cross the line here he sets a 125 dead that's the time everyone is going to have to chase right now as behind we've got a uh, long line of cars now. I've got 126 dead. Uh, S104 131 4. Uh, uh, Gogo 125 4. And S104 uh, and Zinx uh, 126 4. So that's 4 fastest for him. Pikachu 126 9, 5th fastest. Uh, Billy is into the pits again. So uh, looks like many drivers are finding it hard to actually get a good lap in right now. Ivana now crossing the line. A 125 6. That's 3rd fastest for him. That's a good lap from him. And now Jazzy will be coming up, coming up to the line now. And Jazzy here crossing the line. Can he improve? Yes, he can. And 125.9. That should take him safely into Q2 uh, now. Q3, sorry. Uh, and Nii has not improved. So Nii is going to have to find some time. ASM 126.1. That's him 7th fastest now. Crossing the line. Can Nii get the fastest time? Yes, he can. It's a 125 dead. That slots him just in front of Romza by 11 thousandths of a second now. Zinx, two personal best sectors. A AMW improved to a 126.2, that's ninth fastest for him at the moment. He's still in the drop zone. Zinx, 125.7, fifth fastest for him. And Pikachu now rounding the final corner. He is going to need to try and improve right now. And Pikachu crossing the line. And his lap time, it's not an improvement, that's still 11 fastest for him. ASM. Uh, so that's disconnected. I think he crashed out actually and we missed that. So he's going to be out in qualifying now. We are going to be rounding the final corner now. Pikachu gets on the curb but he's kept it clean now crossing the line. He needs this to be a good lap as he crosses the line. And is it going to be good enough? No it's not. So that's going to be ASM, AMW, Pikachu and Billy out in Q2. Going down towards the line. He's kept this relatively clean lap here crossing the line. The 125.5, that's the benchmark for everyone to chase. Gogo 126.1, he's not been able to do beat that. S104, 126.3, Zinx only a 126.3 as well. Nii has dropped off his time, I think. And then now Romza will be crossing the line, and he's going on to provisional pole with a 125.4. That's very tight though at the top there. 
and currently so five drivers are currently within about a second of each other so not bad for those drivers out there and he needs to get a good middle sector for sure as this lap it will be defined by that Algar purple in the middle sector Roms are purple in the first sector Algar could actually do a good lap here if he can hold this one together going down to the final back straight now and final corner up the road going through the final corner and so Algar now going to be crossing the line can Algar snatch pole position at the moment, yes, it's a 124.9 and Roms has gone slow in the middle sector. He's not been able to improve. He needs to get a good final sector if he wants a shot of getting pole right now. Jazzy now, he's got a slipstream of knee now, crossing the line. Can he improve? Yes, he can. His third fastest wheel, 125.5. That is going to be his uh, grid spot then, unless he can still improve. Uh, Gogo, uh, 126 dead for him. Zinx, a 126 dead. But Roms are now rounding the final corner and he's backed out of his lap. So that's going to be Algar on pole, I think. Unless Ni nee can do something about it. Ni, nee, I believe he's on a flying lap right now. The final corner hits the curb though and now ERS deployment down this main straight. Can he improve? Ni nee crossing the line and he's not improved. So it's going to be Algar on pole and Roms are alongside him in second.